Welcome to my channel. Being devoured alive by a wild animal while camping is generally seen to be the worst scenario. Stephen Vouch, who was resting in the woods when he woke up to discover a black bear chewing his arm, experienced this exact thing. While it was undeniably horrifying, Stephen's fast thinking and good fortune allowed him to escape the bear's grasp and eventually seek the assistance he needed. We'll examine Stephen Vouch's amazing near-death experience in this video, from its beginning to how he survived. Kindly subscribe to this channel and like this video if you want to receive future updates from us. The Story of Stephen Vouch and Black Bear Stephen Vouch decided to take a nap in the afternoon while on a camping vacation in the woods. He sat down under a big tree and fell asleep after a while. He had no idea that his nap time would result for him in a horrific encounter with a wild animal. In the vicinity, a black bear was currently finishing up his supper when he strayed in. It was hungry because it had been pursuing him for a while. The bear had lived in these forests for a long time and had only sometimes come into contact with people. The bear approached Stephen in a leisurely, curious motion as he started to nod off. Stephen vouch slept without realizing that the black bear was only a few inches away from him in the woods. The bear finally made up its mind to investigate more closely this new creature Stephen while sleeping in its den while keeping its eyes glued on Stephen. The bear slowly inched closer and closer until it was standing right next to Stephen, prepared to bite him. The black bear approached Stephen's sleeping bag while he was peacefully dozing off. Stephen's arm was being clawed by the bear while he didn't realize it and the creature had his arm in its mouth. Stephen froze in fright when he awoke in terror. It was an incredible sight to behold, and Stephen quickly realized he was in the presence of a wild animal. He was both terrified and fascinated by the bear as it snacked on his sandwich and chips right in front of him. He knew he needed to act fast to ensure his safety and the safety of his property. After stopping, the bear turned to face Stephen and seemed shocked that he was awake. The bear let go of Stephen's arm and began to slowly retreat. Stephen remained still and pretended to be dead until the bear turned and started to wander away. Stephen was shocked when the bear left after playing dead and turning around. He began to walk back to his house while his arm was still severely bleeding. He could feel himself getting weaker and weaker as he walked. Having walked for an hour, he eventually arrived at safety. After reaching safety, Stephen headed to the hospital to receive medical attention for his wounds. Stephen had a hard road to recovery following surgery. He was fortunate enough to escape significant harm, but his arm was severely hurt. Stephen had a lot of emotional healing to undertake in addition to the physical harm. Fortunately, Stephen had a fantastic network of allies. His neighborhood, family, and friends came together to support him during this trying time. They offered emotional support and even coordinated fundraising activities to assist with medical costs. The risks of camping in the woods were eventually brought to light by Stephen's tale as it eventually circulated throughout the town. Stephen has subsequently made a full recovery and is doing so with the help of his neighborhood. Stephen made it through his encounter with the black bear. However, he'll never forget the sensation of a wild beast attempting to bite his arm. Black buried Stephen Vouch while he was sleeping. Thank you for watching. That concludes today's video, which I hope you enjoyed. How do you feel about our video? Click the like and share buttons, subscribe for more articles like this, and share. Additionally, add a comment. Until then, be careful 